We call this soy sarita. All right, guys, we're in Jom Tien, right off the beach road, and they're getting ready for another festival right here. But look at this, look at this view you get. And we're right here in Jom Tien so with Kitty. They'll come again, they'll come back to us. Yeah, now. welcome again. And we're at Soy Sarita. Yeah. And this soy is named after the Hotel Crossroads, according to the bolt driver and the vendor. And we're just gonna take a look. And you guys get to see what they have here. Looks like they have lots of food. I don't know if this is an interesting soy or not. I've never been down it. But look at all the Thai food they got. I've never been here either. And this, this way or this road doesn't really go through. So we're going to cut across to another soy. Um, hopefully we have time for that and we'll cut across. But you can see this huge hotel complex. And these rooms are really inexpensive and they're beachfront. And that's what's really nice about the Sarita. And I've stayed here, my buddy Nick has stayed here, my friend Mike's has stayed here, and it's very inexpensive. Yeah, I've actually stayed here before. Um, but it's got this restaurant, Golden View Restaurant. What's up with that? Yeah, that looks cool. Good. Okay, food. And uh, Western music. <laughs> Golden View Restaurant, room for rent, daily rentals. Yeah, I wonder if it's more like the hourly rentals. But it looks like this is a soy that pretty much has food and laundry and gas. Look at this. That's a gas pump. That's a new one. What do you think? Oh, that's a gas pump, micro pump. Okay. So you put your money inside. It's like a vending machine, a gas vending machine. So that's good to know where that's at since I live close by. I ran, almost ran out of gas uh, yesterday. So and there's a couple little bars here. Just hangout bars. This isn't, uh, I, I don't see this as a place where you're gonna hang out other than you're sleeping here. What was that? 100 what? Uh, Breakfast, 100 baht. Oh, so it's cheap. My 149 baht. Oh, 149 baht. Yeah, in residence. I don't know if it's so nice, Kitty. You think that's nice? I don't know about that. The balcony. I wonder if that's actually where Nick stayed. But anyways, this is right off the beach. Why we're showing you this is I notice a lot of them are beachfront and it's so cheap to stay here, to stay in this area. And there's little bars and older Thai dwellings and houses. I wonder if this used to be a popping place back in the day, like really happening. It went from happening to not. You know, when you come explore different parts of Thailand, and, and we're only exploring Pattaya area and Jomtien right now, but you never know what you're gonna find. That's what I love about this area, is as a retired person, you can pretty much go anywhere at any time and you feel pretty safe. I mean, one of the biggest questions I get on my channel are people just texting me and sending me messages. They said, is it safe here? I'm like, uh, what do you mean? Do you need to carry a gun or something? No, but really, is it safe? And the answer is absolutely. I don't mind walking anywhere, pretty much here in uh, in Thailand. How much? I don't know. K and J, welcome. That's another. So, Kitty's checking prices for us. I don't. Why are you checking prices? We already live over here. How much is it? All right, let's look. Let's look. Oh, monthly rental. All right, so seven thousand baht. Thank you. Uh, Not available, right? Not available. But 7,000 baht a month. That's cheap. Oh my God. That's really cheap. And uh, you got Budget Friendly Inn right in front of us, which I think, do we walk down that way? I think we walk that way, Kitty. Yeah. 
Yeah, and the Sorcerita ends, it doesn't go through to Second Road. But there's a cutover that goes to another soy, which has a real name. Which I think we have to go back. Let's go back and go through that alley. All right, we're gonna go through this alley over here. Anyways, guys, if it's safe. The, you know, the most dangerous thing I've ever had to watch out for are the soy dogs. Soy dogs, dangerous, right, Kitty? You were scared of them, soy dogs. Soy what? Soy Where? Uh, in the front. Have the oh, well, this is called Soy Swenson. Uh, oh, I hope we make it in time. I want to show people. We'll, we'll walk a little faster right here. So you got the lobby of this place. A2C Jomtium Beach. Anyways, guys, you feel pretty safe here. And uh, oh, it's got a cross. Christian Church cross. All right. Big area to hang out, dining. Hotel. Yeah, it's a hotel or, well, there's apartments here too. But yeah, this looks like hotel. Oh, got the cat. Eat the dog, eat the cat. We don't eat dogs and cats here in Thailand. People in Thailand eat, eat, cat, eat dogs. Who? Um, Who eats cats and dogs, Kitty? Eat dogs. Nobody eats dogs in Thailand. Oh, I, I forget. Uh, <laughs> eat dogs. But guys, you won't be eating. Promise you. Promise you. All right. So we're just doing a big loop. And you'll notice these are the older apartments and hotels. And it doesn't look like a nice area. You can see that doesn't go through. Soy Swenson. All right, and that's because there's Swenson's ice cream shop <laughs> over here at the end, guys. Yep. But this is an actual name of a soy. But you can see here, it's, if this is as dangerous as it gets, you, you can't use, oh, I'm scared because I might get mugged or beat up or something. Can I be honest with you? I've walked around Bangkok two o'clock in the morning kind of staggering out of the bar. I'm not saying you need to stagger out of the bar, but kitties walked at night and I don't like that. I don't like it when she's walking out at night. I'm protective that way, but I'm not so much fearful of someone mugging her as I'm fearful of an accident taking place. You know, a car hitting her or a motorbike. Because there are close calls of cars and motorbikes you know, people drive crazy. But yeah, as for safety, this place is awesome. Super safe, you know. Um, I, I, I think it's a safe place to live. What do you think, Kitty, safe place? Yeah. yeah? What's the most dangerous thing here? Not, uh, not uh, people too much, no. Huh? I think a uh, soy is good than a uh, soy. Soy two, soy four. You think that's dang more dangerous? Yeah. The soy two, three, and four? Because, <laughs> because have many restaurants, many bars. What do you think? There are many bars there, so take what a look at that video. I, I don't know if there's that many bars, period. Jump Tien is a quiet place. Really big, big building, huh? Yeah, big buildings. If you, if you have money, you can buy the one building and... I could buy a building? Should I buy a building? Yeah. How much do you get? Maybe We're getting our good steps in today. Oh, so Winston? Uh, Soy Swinson. Well, well, we'll see if we can get a little video of Soy Swinson for you guys. Okay. We're headed towards the beach right now. And we're... We're doing that a good little clip now. Look at this, room for rent. 650 baht, boom. Maybe you want to live in there, live in there? Oh, that's for a night. But good bars, good clubs, good stuff. If you're retiring here in Pattaya Jamtian area, super safe. Good place to come, good place to live. 
One of the reasons why I chose this place is it's safe. And as I get older, you know, I don't want to put up a people's trap or anything, but I don't really have to, and they don't have to put up a mine. It's a safe place. And there it is, Soy Swenson, our favorite ice cream shop. What do you think, Kitty? Favorite ice cream? That's it. Soy Swenson. Soy Swenson. I'll put the details where we're at down below. See you guys in the next video. You don't want to eat at the